Hey Pisces, welcome back to my channel and thank you for being here for your reading. We are going to be looking at the predictions for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and also if you're dealing with the Pisces um, to the cross watches as well, this definitely can be for you. Um, before I begin, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, that would be great. Um, feel free to drop a like uh, on the channel as well. Um, otherwise, let's see what's coming up for you, um, Pisceans. Okay, the card fling out there. Five of Pentacles reversed. So I see some, you're getting yourself out of some tricky situations, Pisces. You've been doing it tough. Um, okay, and these are coming to an ending. There's a big upgrade coming in for you. Creativity is just really, really flowing. A lot of success worldwide success worldwide offers international um collaborations you're launching something i feel okay cancer energy has come up a couple times in one instance it's reversed the past may resurface for some of you okay someone or something from the past could be a past cancer um it's also a relationship with a feminine energy so Maybe someone wants to collaborate with you creatively. Wouldn't be surprised if you sort of connect with someone. You're coming into that Eight of Pentacles energy. Um, okay, so I feel like career's really taking off for you. Um, I see a launch or your name is putting is, is being put out there in the public sphere. Your name's going to be attached to something or people from overseas are going to want to connect with you and work with you. Um so I feel like you're putting things out there here. A potential long distance relationship or meeting someone foreign. There's also a lot of, to do with travel. Um, the boat signifies a journey. So I feel like things are really taking off to you and it's going to lead you to different cities, places or countries. I'm seeing new environments for you. Um, but I feel like it's for the purposes of work or something that's been back and forth. I also feel like two distinct offers are coming forward here. So I feel like there's the word that comes to mind is offers and counter offers but financially there's a huge leap you're going from the two to the five to the eight so um i feel like there's best case scenario um and i really think you're, you're finishing something here this is a cycle that's to be finished your water energy has come through the moon and the two of pentacles it's things in waves though i see you emerging from something here you can see the crustacean emerging from the water i feel like this is you so kind of a bit like a fish out of water in particular towards the beginning of the month i feel like you're sort of you're stepping out of something that's it's it's not your comfort zone though pisces this is something new um, something you haven't done before, a relationship, um, a long distance relationship, an international offer. It's something that's going to sort of um, definitely put you out there um, and you'll be, you'll be feeling a lot of different things because of this, because of this exploration. But I think the universe is probably giving you this push to push you out of your comfort zone. You do, you have a gift, Pisces, and I feel like you're really showing it to the world and I think, I think you're you're going places in terms of putting things. You're making things set in stone. So I'm getting contracts or making a relationship official. This is sort of things that are written in stone. We've got destiny at play here. The stars of the canopy with a chariot is about movement. There's progression, but like. A part of you could be holding back because of the past Pisces or your past is preventing you from moving forward. It can be past pains, healing or trauma that's going to resurface for you during this time. And it's something you have to work through and merge triumphant though. So I feel like you're going to wrap something up or come through some sort of breakthrough. But there's definitely matters of creativity and the heart are somehow connected. So some of you could be sort of um, meeting a love connection or nurturing a love connection through your creativity or creativity is needed in a love connection to keep it going. Um, but the world card is you're really going to have a different perspective. And I think that's because you're emerging to different, different levels in your consciousness. You're emerging into different environments, different stages of your life. And it's all really, it's all really being showcased here. And I definitely feel like you're manifesting that. 
I think your past does want to communicate though. So let's see what this past energy is trying to say. Come up a couple times. Unresolved past issues or traumas or pains are being activated for you. Maybe your person. Okay, I can't stop thinking about you. I am becoming a better person. Just being near you is intoxicating. Okay, someone definitely has you on their mind. And this person is trying to become a better version of themselves for you, Pisces. You are the prize in their eyes. So, Five of Pentacles, this could be someone who has been neglectful, who didn't appreciate you. It's a person or an energy that was disloyal, neglectful, hurtful, wasn't ready is what I'm getting. But they may be coming back because now is another chance to come together at the right time, the right place, the right energy. It's funny how time works and what time does to opportunities, relationships, offers, milestones. And I think the world card is telling me that all these possibilities are opening up to you before. Now that you're going to be stepping out of your comfort zone, you're going to see them a lot more. You're going to attract them a lot more. I definitely feel like I'm getting energy, uh, an energy where someone is really taken away, taken aback by your energy, Pisces. Now, it could be romantic that you're literally just, you've cast this spell on them, Pisces. They're becoming obsessed. They're all, they just think about you, how your day's going, what you're doing. They want to see you successful or they see you as, as a success. But it could also be someone from a creative or a professional level as well. So they're coming forward and they're very enticed by your ideas, your brilliance, your creativity. And you are coming up as the inspiration. So you're definitely inspiring people. But it's not just one. For some reason, I feel like it's multiple people. And they may be from your past in a way like maybe you work together, you went to school together, you had similar interests when you were younger. Could also be strong female energy. Regardless, this is someone who is seeing you as an inspiration. Now, I'm not surprised. If you're on that world stage, you're inspiring other people. You're giving them ideas. They want to know about you. They want to follow you. A lot of you are finding fame or fortune, potentially. Um, and I feel like just you find, because you'll be so in alignment, okay, yes, you might be you, a bit like a fish out of water, but you'll be attracting these people. And they'll be you'll be drawn to them they're going to be drawn to you. It's just how this energy is working. Let's see what else is coming up in terms of your manifesting, your manifestations, Pisces. I feel like it just there's, there's all sorts of different energies coming up around you. Let's take three cards. Okay, six of cups, this notion of the past, um, a past life. A past regret, an opportunity to pick up a project you once left behind or a relationship is coming back. Um, it's lingering, but I also feel like you have, uh, there's a goal, a particular goal, something that you, you've always wanted for yourself in your life and it's finally coming more into view. You're actually getting closer to that goal. Um, look at these cups. It's like a few more stepping stones to go until you reach this beautiful crystal tower. So it's within reach is what I'm saying, much more than it ever was before. Okay, perspective. I mentioned perspective changing. We've got the uh, duality as a fish. You're quite dual. Could be Gemini twins coming through here. There may be communication or a Gemini that has some sort of influence on you or is going to help you in some way to see things differently. Okay, and the last card you had is the Queen of Crystals. Massive upgrade. She is the Queen of Pentacles here. Um... Leo influence here potentially as well. So it could be a promotion or really dominating in your field. You having the upper hand in a situation. Very nice, Pisces. Welcome in this change. A lot of you may be fearing it. Okay, you might be scared. Like, I don't know what to expect. Um, this is out of my comfort zone. I'm not usually like this. I don't usually go for this person. Or this isn't the conventional way of doing things. But it's going to work for you. There's a reason why you're being guided to this. You have to trust you know, perspective is 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 going to be very different for you. And if you try to put a positive spin on it, you're going to see that you'll be thinking more positively about these things. But it could be an earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or something in your career that's really being elevated here. Um, 
you've got a lot of ideas next to you there. There's a lot of crystals. So there's a lot of healing power and you've got a lot of fuel, like motivation, people around you. You've got quite a few eggs in your basket is what I'm seeing, Pisces, more than you're aware of. Count your blessings. Cancer energy, maybe. The moon coming forward again. I'm getting the word glimpse. So this could be a glimpse of what's to come. And from this angle, from this perspective, it's looking pretty damn delicious. I really love this for you. I feel like there's an incoming change. You've got wonderful major arcana cards. You've got this influence over people that's unprecedented, unparalleled. You're really breaking barriers. You're breaking with tradition, with convention. And trust me, you're really going to thrive. Whatever this is you're fearing because you're not used to it, you're, you'll be genuinely surprised how much you're going to thrive in this relationship, in this work setting, in this talent, in this industry, in this next part of your life. It's just, it really is going to be amazing. But I get like a glimpse, could be like a preview or a feature, something like this. A glimpse, a taste of what's to come is what is surrounding you. This is very exciting. I feel like there's something this is culminating to something very exciting. And I think these stepping stones are coming back up for a reason. Things are more in sight, more in view. You're more on track than you previously were really powerful reading but i'm gonna leave it there so thank you for watching pisces i hope that has been helpful and we shall be connecting again very soon so have a wonderful month ahead lots of love and angel blessings and until next time bye for now